Okay, today we're going to talk about the 3D printed version 2.5s of the Rudy the Robot, the 1968 Remco toy. That's so huge. And uh, there'll be links down below if you want to see this guy in action. If you want to see the how I designed the CAD files for this, printed the parts, built it, did the electrical, all that good kind of stuff. But let's get this guy out of the way. Uh, you've seen the difference in scale. And let's let's move in on these guys. So um basically got a single double A battery on off switch and forward and reverse bump switches. So and there's also flashing lights. So as the robot walks into something like that D cell battery, it'll then reverse and walk back the other way. And I put a battery in the back, so then it would go forward. And of course, this guy works the same way. So that's the basic function of the toy. If it had a, a wall or something it was going to bump into, it would bump the little switch and then walk back away from it. Like say the uh, other videos show how it's uh, constructed and all that. And it's got the swinging arms. And the arms, of course, you can pose. You can bring them up higher. And the switch can move a little on its own. It's not 100% perfect, but it's pretty good. On one of them, I did the uh, the switches in three different ways and ended up just keeping two of them. First one, the piece of metal that moves in there that does the switch. It's normally open when it's walking forward, closes when it's walking in reverse. Originally I did it with just a wire coming off the part that moves on here, but the, this moves so easy due to the size of the robot that, that was the wire itself was acting like a spring and making things erratic. So on this one I uh, went ahead and the piece of metal that moves back and forth connected to the metal rod and then put a brass wiper down on the inside that simply rubs on the rod which adds a little friction but also electrically connected it so that worked out quite well on this one I decided what I'd try to do is it's not really visible here but is in the other videos I did a whole brass tube insert that the metal rod rides in so that then is it makes the electro connection on the rod, the rod on the piece of metal, and the piece of metal goes back and sticks to the magnet, then that gives you the reverse. In reverse, it's energizing the double pole, double throw relay. When it's walking forward, it's just the motor running on the one and a half volts. The uh, flashing LEDs are running on the five volt step up inverter at all times. The relay only draws five volts from that step up inverter when it's in reverse. So. There's your basic functions. Um, I'll be working on getting the uh, STO files up to Thingiverse and printables as soon as possible. And then I'll add the link into the description down below.